Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel OS VFX. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to design creative folded paper slide in PowerPoint. In this slide, I have added four stages. Stage one, the detailed description is given here and I've added some dummy graphs. If you want, you can add your own graphs here. Then the stage two, stage three and stage four. So let's see how to create this slide in PowerPoint. Add a new slide and go to view, enable the guides, insert tab, select shape and select rectangle and draw the rectangle till this much and the height of the rectangle should be uh, three inches and make it no outline and you can give some a lighter color here make it enable center align center and align middle press ctrl d to make a duplicate of this one again this also make it align center align middle and you can just reduce the size to half and for this fill you can give some darker colors here I will add a gradient effect to this rectangle select the rectangle under format shape fill say gradient fill and you can just use uh, this which is uh, a gray background 35 percent darker and which is the third stop which is 85 percent and then you can make it the 5 percent darker here now I'm just going to make a duplicate of this rectangle reduce the size this is enough then I'm going to make one more rectangle by pressing ctrl D bring this down here reduce the size and then I'm going to add shape select a triangle and go to format rotate say right 90 degrees bring it here reduce the size and make it no outline for this also I'm just going to use the gradient color you can use some darker color here maybe like this and for this I'll make it transparent to 100% press ctrl D bring the other side and rotate it to flip horizontal bring it here and you can just reduce a little bit size here alright the same thing I'm just going to copy press ctrl D and I'll bring it here so this only we have to what you have to do is select this one and make it flip vertical otherwise it looks uh, in a different way then yes now you can see that the folder paper images is coming now now take the whole thing up maybe here and I'm just going to select these two images uh, sorry the objects press ctrl D and I will just rotate the shape now and then I'm going to select this image press ctrl D bring it here and this one you can bring it here and I will just say solid fill with a darker background and then I'm just going to do the same thing press ctrl D and put it inside now press ctrl D just rotate it sorry yeah alright so if you can see here it will look something like this we can just give some a darker shade also here for this also I'm just going to use some gradient fill and I will rotate this also and make it somewhat lighter color 
yeah all right the similar thing you can just copy this one and press ctrl d and you can just add it here now if you want to add some text you can just add the text here i will say insert text i'll just say first step make it bold increase the size center align and put it here and if you have some icons you can just copy the icons here reduce the size yeah and apart from that one you can just add if you see kind of a grid here for that i have just used a simple table add maybe four or five reduce the size and bring it here further reduce select the whole table and shading make it no fill and for the pen color i'm just going to use say a black and borders just add the borders here all right you can just see that one and then if you have any graph with you you just can add the graph so for me i have just add this graph it's control c and bring it here you can just add the graph like that so once you do all these things then your file will look something like this stage one stage two stage three and stage four so that's it from me friends hope you like this video and don't forget to subscribe my channel always vfx see you soon with more interesting stuff till then goodbye